Today in this video, we are going to see how to install Apache JMeter in Windows machine step by step. Before we proceed further, I welcome you all again to our Little Sla YouTube channel. And this is your Vasant Shamugam. In this series of videos, we are going to see about JMeter and its various performance testing techniques. We can install JMeter in four simple steps. Let's see them one by one. First, install Java. Let's see how to install Java in our local Windows machine. Before we install Java, let's understand why Java. So JMeter is a pure Java desktop application and it requires a fully compliant Java virtual machine or higher to run JMeter successfully. And we can download and install the latest version of Java SE development kit. And before downloading Java, let's check whether our system has JDK installed and let's see how to do it. Go to search bar and open command prompt. In command prompt, let's open and see whether we have Java installed. So since it says Java is not recognized as an internal or external command, operable program or batch file, we can understand that Java is not installed. So as a first step, let's install Java in our Windows machine. And here I have pasted the link of Java installation. I will post this link in the description section for your reference. We have given the URL and let's click enter. So now we are taken to Java downloads page. Let's now go to the JDK to download it. Let's now select Windows. And here we can see the installer file. Let's download it. We will see how to install JMeter in Mac OS and Linux in our other videos. So we have got our JDK uh, download in our machine. Let's now install it. So now the installation has started. Let's see the step one by one and let's complete the Java development kit installed in our machine to run JMeter. So the installation goes this way. Let's click next. And then again, just select the location. It will be the default C folder and program files. And let me click next. And it starts to get installed. So the installation is in progress. Let's wait for some more seconds to complete. So now we have completed the installation. Let's close this window and let's verify in the command prompt. So let's now verify with the same command we have tried earlier. So still we are facing that the Java is not recognized. 
So let's now try another way. The next step I would say that is setting up the environment variable. So let's do it now. So let's search for environment variables here. And let's select this edit the system environment variables, which is under control panel. Let's open it. And here we get this system properties window. And under this, we can select this environment variables button. Click on it. And then we get this environment variables window. Let's go to the path then select the path here under system variables and click on edit and click new and paste this location which is where the JDK is installed and select this location under the bin folder and click on OK and let's now see whether the Java works now in our mission. And once you are done with all these setup, close the command prompt and reopen command prompt. And now type Java hyphen version. So now we are done with the Java installation. Let's now move to the third step that is download Apache JMeter's latest version from the Apache JMeter website. And so here again I'm pasting the link. I will paste this URL again in the description section. Let's enter the URL and click enter and now we'll navigate to the Apache JMeter download page. Let's now download the zip file with the latest version under binaries which is Apache JMeter 5.4.1.zip. Let's download it. It'll take few seconds to download. The download is completed now. Let's now extract the file and do the installation setup. And now I'm extracting the folder here. I've created a new folder under C drive and I'm extracting the files. Clicking on OK. And a new folder is getting created here. Since we have installed the latest version of Java, there should not be any issues in running or in opening the JMeter. Let's see once the setup has been done. So now we are done with the extraction. Let's now move into the JMeter folder. And let's now go into the bin folder and here we can see the jmeter.bat file. Let's double click and see what happens. So since this is the first time, the setup is taking a little time, little extra time to do all the background setup.
and here we have got our Apache J meter gets opened. So we have successfully completed the J meter installation. So let's again, let's once again recap the steps we have, we have done. So the first thing is we have installed Java since we have not installed Java in our machine. So install the latest version of JDK in your machine. And secondly, set up the environment variable under the path section. Let me just bring it now once again. So under the edit system environment variables, open the environment variables window and under system variables, go to the path and add the bin folder and in case if you feel it might fail add this java home slash bin as well click ok and confirm in a new command prompt that the java is installed and once you confirm the java installation Download the file from this location under jmeter.apache.org and download jmeter.cgi and download the latest version with the zip folder downloaded in your machine. Extract the files. And once you extract the file, open the folder and get into the bin folder and run double click and run the jmeter.bat file and the apache jmeter window will get opened and now you are ready to start your performance testing using jmeter i hope you like this video please don't forget to share subscribe and like my channel we will see how to use the various components of jmeter and how to run a performance test and we will see various other techniques as well please do follow our channel and we will this we will see you on another interesting video thank you once again